I would welcome you to my lair, but such courtesies are usually denied to intruders. Especially ones who interrupt important meetings. Still, if we're going to talk, I suppose introductions are needed, yes? My name is Altama. As you might have guessed, I am the leader of the Ebon Claws. You're lucky my chief advisor is a sorceress with a talent for divination. She tells me that you have spoken true. You are no night mask, but rather one who suffers by their hand. Perhaps, Altama. I sense that the mask the intruder spoke of originated with the night masks, but I'm unsure whether they affected the curse themselves. Who else would have affected it? Zymina? Are the night masks not malicious enough for such a thing? Are they not cunning enough? Your magic is handy, but my eyes will tell the truth of this. The intruder will show us the mask now, yes? Yes, yes. The night masks leave masks such as this on the bodies of their prey in order to mark their kills. You're a different sort of prey, but I doubt your fate will be any happier. Not without the help of the Ebon Claws. We of the Ebon Claws know more about the night masks than they suspect. We could help you with that cursed mask of yours in exchange for... Certain services. 
I could always sick my minions on you and put the ebon blood in your veins. But I have enough were-rats under my control. For now. What I need is someone who's comfortable above ground, in the places that lie just beyond our grasp. Your decision pleases me. Do as I ask, and I will see that your problem is solved. Yes, yes. You will not regret this alliance. I'm glad you decided to throw your lot in with the Ebon Claws. I don't know if I could stand to work with those sanctimonious twits at Morningstar Haven. So, we are to work with criminals. I can't say I'm pleased. But perhaps the low path is sometimes the best way. To start off, I have a job suited to one who is not of our kind, as it involves hunting one who knows the ebon blood when he smells it. He knows because he was once one of us. His name is Rugular. Had you come to me a few weeks ago, you would have found him standing here among my most trusted advisors. Now he believes he can simply abandon the Ebon Claws, taking with him not only the secrets I have entrusted to him, but a number of important documents as well. Yes, yes. Rugular is very foolish to think he can escape us. The knowledge he possesses cannot be allowed to fall into the clutches of our enemies. You will find this betrayer for me and kill him. Yes. We have been searching for Rugular for many nights, but his nest is not easily found. He knows our ways and has hidden himself far from our territories. However, I have received word that a halfling named Podrick Lagrance knows of Rugular's whereabouts. You will seek out this halfling in the Market Triangle and listen to his information. Find Rugular and kill him. Take from him the stolen documents and return them to me. Do these things and you will be rewarded, and our alliance sealed. Now leave, and do not return here lest you draw more attention to our den. From now on, you will meet me at a shop called Sods and Sundries. I will await you there. My steel shall lead the way! If you need something looted, I'm your woman. Yes. <laughs> 